the collateral damage this all devastating situation we are having in Gaza there is no forgiveness from Allah forget it I'm telling you there is no forgiveness for us I don't know why are we surviving on the first shot especially men this is what Allah's grace on us but trust me we do not even deserve to live and quality of life I said this is beyond even imagination why are we getting this all you see I learn in physics when the tides of the shore when the when the waves of the shore are very you know subtle or not moving much or they are empty so there is a tide in the other direction because the water goes there creating a tide so we think that there is no problem but actually the tide is coming to us every one of us and if we do not wake up now maybe Allah will reverse this damage the only thing we need to wake up we need to be united we should be protesting we should talk we should open our voices Prophet says that if you have power if you see evil if you have power stop it by your hands if not by your tongue we can speak we can speak Allah has given us power of speech we can speak we can educate the Western people who are being brainwashed and programmed by these Jewish monopoly this Zionism and especially those slaves wasp white Anglo-Saxon Protestants who are just licking the boots of these Jews we can reprogram their people their followers to see how much things are doing it's very amazing Jews they according to them Jews consider Jesus Christ the son of Pandera they call him bastard Pandera was a Roman soldier alleged allegedly raped Mary according to the Jews astaghfirullah and Jesus was produced we Muslims on the other hand believe in Jesus one of the mightiest messengers of God and they call us Antichrist and they embrace those people